Hi there, and welcome to a sample problem from the Smarter Balanced Assessment for 7th grade. Here we go. This is just off of the uh, sample test site. This is in the public domain, so help yourself. There's lots more. I'm just going to give you a uh, strategy on this question. Okay, we've got an equation right here with conditions. And we've got A, B, and C, which represent three numbers. So we've got these equations over here. One, two, three, four. And our job is to take these and drag them into the boxes to make each equation true. Well, <clears throat> excuse me, excuse me. Let's uh, remember the one rule that I've taught in class which is same sign, positive answer. That's the only rule you need to remember. Okay? And for this equation, this particular one, we need to have one each, A, B, and C in each equation. Okay? So here we go. This has positive answer, so I need negative B. Same sign, positive answer. Here's another one with a positive answer, so I need same sign, negative C. Here I have a negative answer, which means I need opposite sign. You need opposite signs to have a negative answer in both of these problems. Since that's a C, I need a B and an A, and they need to have opposite signs. So since I haven't used one yet, let's see, let's see. Oh, I better go negative A and positive B. That'll get it done. I could also go positive A and negative B, right? We have choices here. You can use uh, you can use a letter more than once on a problem like this, okay? And down here I can have negative C over positive B or I could have positive C over negative B. You know what else we could do down here? Well, that's it. Okay, that takes care of it. So, simple problem. It could look very confusing, which is uh, what I think they're hoping for here. There's uh, one, two, three, four, five, six answers that you have to complete. But uh, the bottom line is, if you remember same sign, positive answer, make sure you have an A, a B, and a C in each thing. And hey, if you had to, you could do a simple sample problem like this to uh, test your theory out, okay? For example, if I had negative 2 times negative 3, I would get positive 6, right? That works. So you can test your uh, theories out over here. That's going to do it for this one. Stay tuned for more. There's more coming. All right. Good luck.